You're probably wondering why the title of this video isn't Yoshi's Strange Quest. I didn't put this on hold. Anyways, I don't think the hack I'm gonna play right now will take as long as well Yoshi's Strange Quest has. And even if it did, I'd probably finish up Yoshi's Strange Quest because I'm very close to doing so. I just need to investigate Wacky World and Rite of Doom, see if they have secret exits. But before I start playing this ROM hack, which is being said in the title of this video, I'm gonna show you this. YouTube, you have been pestering people to use their full names, which will put them in some sort of danger one way or another. But, here is the funny part. I go see what the next screen looks like, it never loads. So YouTube, if you're going to try and force us to use our real names, which some of us clearly won't, at least get your shit together and make it work. Or better yet, don't make it work, so we never have to use our full names, because that would be so much better. Now, let's actually get on to this episode's feature presentation, made by Darkin, I think. Oh, Ninja Negro. Yeah, the name is cool. The title screen is cool. Sort of. Let's see what we're really getting into here. I'm actually a bit nervous. Vetus. Oh, Ninja Negro, Venho Kom Opa. This is a foreign language. Oh, Ninja Negro. I think this translates to the Black Ninja. It's Spanish or Italian, which, whichever. Foreign title and what? Foreign text. I can't even read. Okay, we start. This is just a cutscene that I can't even read. Start select parser. As in to get out of there. Oh, a cutscene I can't even read. <laughs> My, this is actually gonna take some time. This might actually take time. Ninja Negro's got a road up ahead of him. <laughs> Alright, Black Ninja, let's go. More text I can't even read. And that's a fast bullet bill. Floresta do trauma. Force of trauma. Yeah, another foreign hack here. After having played Mario XXX, you could pretty much expect me to be unable to know anything from here. <laughs> yeah, this is from Squire Wall Stars where you're fighting Bowser, like the last one, which is the real one. And yeah, these bonsai bills are a little too fast, if you ask me. a lot of time to react to those huge bonsai bills. Maybe that's why they move slower in the original game. Now that they're moving this fast, they can just catch you off guard. Nothing else is wrong, really. The only reason they're moving so slow is I don't even know if another bonsai bill will just show up and totally catch me off guard. And... Okay, I've never seen that happen before. When I step on one of those guys, they actually turn into a flying one. Message that I can't read. Vos Tem Agora. I'm not even gonna try and read this. Oh man, I like the face on him. And... Oh, now where do I go? If I'm supposed to read what's in the message, I'm fucked. Quiver os blocos de gelo e evit perde e pude. Maybe if I can translate this, maybe that'll explain what the hell is going on here. Gonna whip up Google Translate, even if it doesn't do such a good job. I figured it out. I think this is actually Portuguese. Google says it's Portuguese. I thought it was Spanish. It actually says you now have the power of the fireball. Break ice blocks and avoid losing this power. Except I don't have the power of the fireball. I can't break ice blocks, I assume. And I'm still gonna try not to lose this power. And start select does not even work. So I'm stuck here. And there's no time limit, so I gotta commit suicide. So I'm gonna keep the mushroom. That's a nice way to begin the game. Pyramid do ninja! Let's go! <laughs> Faro ninja, he he, va oh, I can't even read any of this. Okay, I thought that was ground. 
thought Ninja Negro was gonna stand on some ground. I was dead wrong. I'll just go for this. <laughs> okay, I get to keep this power up, that's good. So it wasn't a total waste to go through that first level. How does this piece of ground work? Ow. Okay, we know very well that that's just gonna drop bombs. And we have to avoid the bombs. This is easy enough, I mean. It should be. We're in the first world here. This isn't too bad at all. It's realistic! It makes sense. There's logic to this. Except for the fact that you had to, like, well... You were forced to die in the first level because there was no exit to it. Other than that, still. And I don't even know where to land. It would have been nice if I actually saw where I was landing first, but... I don't even know where to go. Uh-oh. There's another wall? These albatrosses aren't helping. Okay, now I think I'm stuck on another wall? Knock out the enemies. Make it easier to think. Can I not pass through the wall? I'm gonna have to save state and just check around. Oh. Should've known. It's another of those blind drops. You could use coins, you know, to indicate that I've triggered something. I don't even know what this is. Oh, it's a message box. Fire Ninja, Grump. I'm not even gonna try and read what I can't understand. Okay, now I have the power of the fireball. Wait, what? Now I lose it. I honestly didn't know that they would do that. Never seen a shy guy do that before, so I don't want to do the entire level. Now I have to use fire to break through these blocks. Okay, now we have the power of the fireball. Before, we didn't. This time, we do. And if we lose it, then, yeah, we lose the level. Because there's no reset door. This guy isn't nearly as forgiving as Yoshi Fanatic, from what I can assume. Okay, now I have to make a little tricky jump. Oh, I hit my head on the ceiling there. That would be nice. <laughs> now let's try not to shoot fire. And these guys... You can't jump on them, otherwise you get hit. I thought a shy guy was something you could ride on. Or you could jump on it and not get hurt. There's no spikes on these things, head. It's just like Rumia when you fought her in ASMT. You thought you could jump on her. Well, depending on what she did first. You think she could... Uh-oh. <laughs> the boss. That I can't hit. Except with Goombas. Oh. Well, these look like Goombas, so yeah. I can hit... And then I die to something. Ah, oh, I gotta read this. How many lives do I have? Wait, one? I'm gonna have to play through this thing entirely if I want to give it a rating. So far, I'm only on the second level, and I've lost them all. Nice. No, not really. Oh. Well, we'll keep trying. Okay, we're, I think we're, yeah, we're back at the boss. And now that I know you're not supposed to jump on it, this will go a bit better, I can only imagine. Just jump on the Goombas, you don't even have to throw them at them. It's simple enough, I mean. I should be able to get this right. I hope. There we go. And now where are we? The ending. Okay. Okay, the overworld path didn't work right now. It's just empty black squares. Dia, Tard, Anoint. How was I supposed to know that was a spy? I think I'm gonna spin jump on everything because I'm not even sure. Okay, let me go 
back up and figure out what's going on here. That's a solid wall, I think. What's going on here? That's pushing me away. Star man. Except that I don't even know what to do here. I'm, s I'm stuck here. Why would I even... Why would you even put this ledge? If you just get stuck here. This is pointless. Oh, great. Try again. That ledge is pointless. That thing is just screwing me over. Oh, great at that again. I move properly now, that's good to know. <laughs> that's simple enough. Let's hope we don't find any more overpowered sprites or something that makes me move weirdly that I don't even know. <laughs> Everything else is fine, oh god. Did you think this through? The player's gonna be trapped in here! Okay, at least I survived it. Looks like the player's just gonna get trapped in there. Yeah, overpowered sprites. These are the elite Koopas from SMWCP, last I remember. And yeah, they're pretty freaking powerful. They shoot like a bunch of fireballs, or like almost impossible to dodge like that. I'm not even sure what's going on. Yeah, these are glitchy paths. Those were called Elite Koopas in SNWCP, and they're some of the most freaking powerful enemies of all time. They shoot all these fireballs, it's, they're almost impossible to bypass when they're doing that. But you can kill them with Koopa shells here. Or you can kill them with a shell of some sort. So if you have a shell attack, you're really lucky at this level. It means you'll be able to kill off some of the strongest enemies really easily. No, there's just a bunch of bullet bill cannons here. Oh, come on! Why did I jump? Now I have to do this again. Okay, how am I gonna remember to bring a shell with me? That would be nice. At least this doesn't look too hard now, I mean. It's not some overpowered sprite. This is definitely looking easier. I just have to time it properly. Okay, now it's looking harder again. As long as you can time it correctly, it should be fine. Oh no, another one of these that you can hardly... They're hardly unkill- Oh, this is a different kind. The one that makes you move in weird directions. The one that just... Pushes you around and doesn't let you move on your own accord. Oh no, now the level continues. Oh, no power-ups too, that's just great. Is this gonna be an- Oh, how was I supposed to know? That's unfair. I call fucking bullshit on that. I'm loading the state. I'm just getting back there now that I know you can't jump on those enemies. Could you even spin jump on them? Let's see. Yep. Yeah. I guess I'm gonna have to spin jump on everything from now on. Because apparently this guy just changes the rules. So you can't jump on enemies. Even if it looks like you could jump on them. There's no spikes on these guys' heads. Now. Excuse me while I actually play the level. Now if I die, I'm actually gonna redo it. I hope I actually redo it. Oh no. Wow, you got a lot of plants in these bushes. A lot of plants here. Okay, let's try and get up here. This level's a little long. And I'm just trying to dodge everything. There's only one power up. No, oh, I don't see that! Long level. Only one power up. This is headed in the same direction as Yoshi's Strange Quest. Not a lot of power ups. No midpoints. Yeah. Maybe it is. I still want to beat this level, though. Please tell me you're gonna put a power up here soon enough. There's no way I could do this without. 
Well, I could, it's just... Okay, we have a power-up. That's the second power-up in this level. Not a lot of power-ups here. And I don't know where to jump, so excuse me if I just save state, because I don't know where I'm supposed to land. Oh, right there. A lot of plants here. Yeah, a lot of plant life. And these plants are sort of friendly. They want him freaking dead. Oh, now where are we? We're flying! Okay, these are shy guys now. Okay, these have their eyes closed. They're sniffets, but they're... They're reskinned to look like sniffets. I mean, they're reskinned, but they act like sniffets. I don't know what I'm talking about here. I gotta figure this out. This level's a little long still to not have a midpoint. You can't grab him. And I don't even know if which of these will hurt me or not. I don't even know. The only way I'm ever gonna figure out is the hard way. Which is so which sucks. These are probably gonna come down. Okay, these work surprisingly surprisingly well. Okay, that's a little much. And the level's still going on. I'm surprised that the level is this long. This is actually gonna take pretty long. I mean, you saw all the levels that were on that one overworld map. And this one just doesn't seem to end. And of course, I seem to be running into this problem a lot lately. No midpoints. So if you die, you redo everything. I'm not even kidding. And it's so easy to die when there's all these freaking plants that want you dead. What did this ninja do to the plants? I mean, come on! Now, a boss! Oh, at least we have power-ups. Except I don't know what to do here. Except I can't kill these things! Great! Boss, I can't even kill? Oh no, don't tell me. Am I supposed to bring a fire flower here, but I don't have one? Okay, let me look at this a bit closer. Let's try to enter every pipe. I hope I don't have to come to an end so soon. On such a negative note, the level I could play, one of the levels I could play was just super long. It didn't want to end. And when it did, it didn't end properly, so I can't even complete it officially. Can't even officially say the level's done. Pretty much stuck in a boss fight that I can't kill. I don't have fire flowers. I don't see anywhere where I could go. I just can't find it. There's nothing here. This doesn't work. If I die, then I just have to redo the whole level again. Of course. Yeah, you redo that entire level. I'm not even kidding. That had no midpoints. Is this hack impossible? We'll figure out later. We'll figure it out after we play the entire level or not. <sighs> what a start.